Wait a second. Something doesn't quite look right. Oh, my dinosaurs are missing. Where they all go? We're missing like, 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 like everyone. Yes. All of our egg layers. They're all missing. <laughs> you guys, I got something awesome to share with you guys. I've been a little bit busy, but welcome back, everybody, to Primal of Fear on the Crystal Isles. I've been a busy little boy today. I've been working on the new base. You might have guessed it. I mean, look around. Come on. Come on. Come on. We're missing, like, pretty much all of our utility Primal Fear dinosaurs, as I'm currently calling them, I suppose. All of our egg layers. All of our special egg layers, aside from, like... Uh, our Celestial. <laughs> it's over from this big old beast of an RG that we tamed up last episode. All of our other fellas are up at the new base, and I cannot... I cannot wait to show you what I've been working on. But before we get into that, before we go and check it out, guys, if I could ever so kindly ask you to go ahead and punch that thumbs up. Make it rain those thumbs up. And while you're at it, subscribe to the channel. We are we are surging towards 700,000 subscribers. We're just around the corner. We might even do it this week. But I need you to subscribe for us to do it. Anyways, guys, 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 this is awesome. I am so happy with what I've been building. It's still a little bit of a work in progress, but... You'll understand it when we get up there, okay? Uh, no, it's not up here. <laughs> not where base 1.0 uh, began. No, 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 no. I just wanted to come up here so I could go for a bit of a glide to go and visit our new base. As, you know, it is literally just over here. Let me see if I can ramp it up. And we've landed it with a little bit of fall damage, but it's A-OK, -okay, baby. All right, all right, all right. I hope you guys were excited. I'm, I'm excited to unveil this. Oh, uh, by the way, it's been a while since I've actually taken you guys up here. So this was stage one. Actually, this was kind of like stage one. We built this. Wait, am I stuck? Okay, that was kind of weird. We built this little like wooden shack here. It's kind of like our little, kind of just like a little house. Got some nice lights up on the roof. We got a bed so we can, or well, two beds so we can spawn here twice, twice as many times. Uh, we got some refining forges that have been smelting up a nice chunk of metal for us. Uh, we still got a long way to go in the metal department because I got to get a grinder. Maybe we'll do that today. We'll see how we go. Um, we got our swing, <laughs> our beautiful swing set. Can I, can I swing on the swing set? Yeah, there we go. Yippee. This is part of the Ark Venture Park mod or something like that. Uh, that lets you build theme parks. And then over here, we've got our little farm, which is actually really, really cool because the greenhouseness crossed with these special little things here pretty much give like a 700% uh, greenhouse effect and give you like a ton. Watch this. You ready? Look at this. This is why, this is why vegetables have been just like popping up so frequently. Hold on. That might take a second. Basically, you grab 149 and then like it, it takes no time at all before it's like completely re- Nope. That was the nitro. Oh yeah. And then the nitro speeds it up again as well. Okay. Is this one topped up? Yeah. Look at that. Bam. It's full again. It's ridiculous. I didn't even know. Anyways. Uh, we're going to head on over to the new base. And I kind of want to look at the ground because I want to, like, unveil it properly. Oh, it's so good. You ready? Hold on, hold on. Whoop. Okay. So you can't quite see it just yet. But here is the new section to the base. Here we go. Three, two, one. Boom. There it is. Ha-ha. What do we have here, Miola? Well, if you, if you walk up to the sign, you'll find out this is Eggsville, baby. This is Eggsville. It's got its own little gate. It's got a little fence. It's pretty cool. Have a look at this. So this is my dedicated egg laying area. It's kind of like our, this is basically our farm part of the map. As you can see, we have a, a massive greenhouse built to my right. Um, it's got built in, uh, it's got a little nest here. We've got a little storage box that just storing all my building resources. Uh, we've got our item collector who is picking up all the eggs that my dudes are laying. And this time around, I've done something that we should have done at the old base, but we didn't do it properly. I placed a refrigerator right alongside it, except the refrigerator is unpowered right now because apparently my generator over there can't reach it. So I've got to fix that. Um, or we could just give it its own generator, I suppose. It is kind of Eggsville. Eggsville des deserves its own generator. Uh, anyways, as you can see, tons of eggs. <laughs> yeah, this took me quite a, quite a while to build. I spent a lot of time on this over the last 24 hours. So my dudes have had plenty of time to just like stock up on laying as many eggs as they possibly can. In fact, I'll just ditch all these veggies in here too. So this is basically like our, um, pretty much all of our Primal Fear stuff. All of the Primal Fear crafts, kibbles, that sort of stuff. It, it all requires uh, these resources. So I figured we'll just have them all in one place. We'll have our veggies here. We'll have our eggs here. We need to steal feathers here. But yeah, you get the gist of it. Oh, and 
He also distributes all of our poop into these here, which they all look pretty full to me already. Wow. Yeah, they're like, wow. All right. My guys, he would lay in a lot of poops by the looks of it. Um, I've got no thatch in there just yet. And then we'll be able to convert that into Gaia Nitro. And then in here is the greenhouse. Oh, that's right. There's two doors. I couldn't, I couldn't just do one. Um, and three here. I haven't really like done this properly. It's kind of still a work in progress. Uh, but this is going to be our little farming spots where we got our, our little seamless crop plots. Uh, it's going to look beautiful by the time we're done. I just haven't worked out how exactly we're going to do it. This took me so long and it's like not even halfway complete. But yeah, and then over here we've got all of our egg laying dinosaurs. We got our fabled RG pair that we tamed up last episode. We've got our little apex dilos, our apex crocodilios. We've got our icy feather lights. We've got our little fabled squad that we tamed up the other day as well. Um, our two omegas over here that still need saddles. They took so long to get into this. Yeah, I'm not even joking. This, this Rex jumped off the cliff like four times before I finally got in, into position. The, Al the Allosaurus was easy. The Rex, gosh, their turning circle is just so big. You just did not want to cooperate. Oh, and then last but not least, our little trio of toxic dodos. So yeah, we pretty much got uh, all eggs covered aside from Celestials and Demonics. Um, but obviously we got the Celestial RG. So now that I've unveiled Eggsville to you all. Hey, by the way, let me know what you think. Do you like my little like egg area? It's probably one of the coolest things I think I've ever built. It's so small, so minimalistic, but it's just so perfect. It's just like a nice little chilled out area. And you might be able to tell I've tried to keep as much of the uh, terrain stuff as possible. We still got bushes. We've still got trees. I didn't want to tear it all down. I wanted to. I wanted the place to have a little bit of character, you know? Like, you know, it's all kind of like built into the jungle. I, I think it looks awesome. I'm really happy with it. I'm like really proud of this one here in case you guys can't tell. But anyways, we should get on with our adventure today. It's going to be a crazy one, I think. I want to set out on an adventure to, if we are lucky, try and take down our very first origin boss. The origins, we've seen them floating around. They're the yellow dinosaurs. Um, we obviously got to head straight back down to the old base because this is where our strong dinosaurs still live. We gotta take a bit of fall damage along the way as well. Um, but yeah, the origins are basically like the tier one bosses for you to take. I think they're tier ones. Or maybe they're tier two. I can't exactly remember how it works. Either ways, we're gonna go looking for some, all right? And then hopefully we're going to slay them. And then hopefully we're gonna get some nice drops out of them. Mainly, I want some origin blood. Origin blood is a very, very valuable resource. Basically, what it lets you do is uh, you can use it to craft up. Also, I should probably drop these structures off. These are my little fencing structures. Uh, but what they let you do is um, you can craft up uh, basically like one-shot knockout bullets. Yeah, that, that's, that's pretty much what they're good for. Um, and then you can use these bullets to one-shot dinosaurs to, to, to tame them. It's awesome. Um, but yeah, we obviously got to like, you know, do the hard work and actually kill us an origin first. Oh, I can't drop my resources off here. Come on. There we go. So yeah, we're going to go on the lookout for one of those. We've seen them around. I just got to remember where we found them. Um, you know what we could actually do soon, right? Hmm. Let me have a little look in here, okay? We should be able to like craft us up a tech generator. Not a generator, a tech... Obl no, what are they called again? The tech thing in my bobbies. Have I actually unlocked any tech stuff yet or not? Primal fit, primal stuff, blah, 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 blah. Do I have a... Um, what am I actually thinking of? Replicator. No, we don't yet. Ah, we got to learn the proper one. So I guess I'm going to kill the broodmother or a boss or something. I don't know. Um, but then the other thing that I was thinking of was a transmitter. Because the transmitter is the awesome item that lets us locate dinosaurs around the map. Uh, except with the S Plus mod, they've actually changed how that works. So it's going to be... It's going to be a little bit different in this series to what we normally deal with. Anyways, let's go. I want to go up to the north part of the map. Um, I guess we'll head to the obelisk and we'll go from there i know that up this north area there seem to be a ton of strong dinosaurs this seems to be like the place to be uh on top of this all i want to uh i want to kill some i want to level up a little bit so i'm hopefully gonna well any basically strong dinosaurs that we encountered today i'm gonna try and kill because why not i think this is a fate yeah this is a fabled woolly mammoth Ooh, nice loot as well we're still also hoping for a nice sniper rifle. Um, someone said last episode that from killing the... I was like reading through the comments. Someone said that we killed... Oh, when we killed the Celestial Rex, that they thought we got a nice sniper rifle drop. But it turns out it wasn't. 
it was just a regular sniper rifle not the primal fear sniper rifle that we're trying to get we really want a really powerful one of those that will help us knock out like everything but i guess we still gotta play the waiting game i'm also a little intrigued about these guys to be honest yo dark mega raptors all right these guys are strong so i don't really want to mess around with it uh but i could try and knock it out and tame it i just don't have any advanced kibble on me uh, so these guys, I guess, are the same tier. They're like advanced elemental tier. So they're the same tier as our light uh, griffin. But it's a mega raptor. I, I kind of like them, to be honest. Oh, I can't actually... I just realized we're not in a griffin anymore. So I can't... And they do that. They do that. That is so darn cool. Oh, I want to tame you up so bad. Um, okay, let me, let me have a little peek through here, okay? So it's going to kill me because I'm not on a griffin. Basically, we're going to have to hop off. So what's that over there? Oh, your horses? Oh, that's him. That's the duck. Why are you over there? Also, is that that's an apex direwolf. Oh, that's kind of cool. All right, hold on. Is he trapped? Is he just decided? Is he going to like, like what? Nope. Nope. Okay. All right. Fine, 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 fine. All right, fine. You want to fight? You want to fight? Come and get it. Come and get some, baby. Also, what did I just... Hold on a second. <gasps> You gotta be kidding me! You gotta be kidding me! Um, why am I still losing health? All right, it stopped. Good. But hello. Uh, this is exactly what I was just talking about. An ascendant primal fabricated sniper rifle. Hello. Um, this is a game changer. What? Why did, what, like, for real? I, like, 10 seconds ago, I literally said to you guys, this is what we need. This is what we're looking for. Um, what is the likelihood that we actually get one of them uh, from killing a dinosaur I wasn't even going to kill? Oh, I'm so glad I killed it now. Oh, that's the best thing ever. Oh, that is so good. Oh, so here's another one. No, that's a feather light, this guy. Oh, <gasps> dark feather light. A lot weaker. Oh, I don't have any interest. Wait, no, I should have tamed it up. Oh, why are you so stupid? What's that? Are these guys? Oh, wow. Oh, oh, they drape, they drop a ton of feathers. Wait a second. I think I harvested the other one. Oh, wow. If that's the case, I'm going to start killing every dark and light dinosaur that I come across. Also, ooh, Primal Tech Rex. Oh, I'm going to kill this guy. He's going to give me some nice loot too, I think. <laughs> yeah. This guy's such a beast. He just one-shots everything. I hope... Well, not that I hope... He will meet his match at some point. The, the time will come where he will stop being able to one-shot a lot of dinosaurs. Um, but he's just hes just the strongest... Or she. She's just the strongest uh, dinosaur that we've found yet this series. Is an, another fabled woolly mammoth. Thank you very much. Uh, I'm just excited about this sniper rifle. I feel like... No, not you. Where did it go? This one down here. So uh, before this, the best one we had was this one. Uh, now we've got 491%. And the beautiful thing about this is we can fire uh, these bullets out of it. I don't think I can fire darts. I can only fire bullets. Uh, but these bullets have been pretty well useless to us up until now. So now that we can actually do that, I'm kind of curious to see what sort of damage they're possible uh, at dealing. I kind of... Well, not damage. Torpor. I want to see, see how good they are at actually knocking stuff out. Another Rudolph down there, but not looking for a Rudolph. Let's head on over to this little area. Ooh, just some griffins. It's all good. This area here is usually quite notorious for having some pretty strong dinosaurs in it. So, like, well, like this guy. I mean, I'm not looking to... I think I could kill that. Could I kill that? They do have reduced, like, reduction damage. I don't know if I even want to try this. But I kind of want to. Kind of want to. All right, you know what I'm going to do? Watch this. We'll spit this bomb out. Except all my bullets went sideways. You're supposed to go in front of me. I wanted him to attack this guy. All right, hold on. If I sit like this. I'm trying to use it. I'm, I'm like, spamming X. There we go. I think I nearly killed. Yeah. All right. Probably a bad idea. Probably a bad idea. I actually don't know how powerful this guy is you got a lot of health though and i only dealt twenty thousand. hey dragon oh gosh all right we are like all right we're in prometheus dinosaur territory out here we probably shouldn't mess around with the prime dinosaurs okay um i would hate to lose a celestial the day after taming it but hey look 
I don't back down. I have pride. Let's go, big guy. You want some of this, do you? Boom. Ooh, scary. Ooh, so scary. So scary. Come on. I just can't hit it. I just can't hit it. Take this one. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right. Get that, boy. No, nah, didn't work either. All right. Okay, 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 okay. Well, you know what? Let me chuck in a health potion real quick. <laughs> just in case. And let's also go super powered. Control C, baby. I am now in ascended form. Look at him. All right, let's go. Boom. I can't hit him. Why not? Hey, there we go. That's what I'm talking about. Boom. Take one of these while you're at it. <laughs> oh, that was the shot. Oh, that was the shot. Dude, that was tough. All right. Now, remind me. Do I get any cool loot out of this guy? There is a backpack. What is inside? We have... Oh, 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 oh. Rex Bionic costume. Some Prome Metal Trank Arrows. Seven elements. And some Prome Ordinary Nano Gaunt. Oh, that's just you. Oh, I just had a mini heart. I just had a little heart attack. Power up. No, I don't want you to... I want to ride you. Wait, what? All right, that is weird. Um, buddy, what are you doing? No, 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 no. Stop powering up and powering down. Uh, I kind of just want to take you for a ride, buddy. Right. Okay, that was kind of weird. Interesting, though. Very, very interesting. Now, you only gained a level out of that. Eh, that's good enough. That's good enough. I'm putting it into speed. We got any experience potions? We do not. But these gauntlets have me intrigued. These gauntlets belong to the Prometheus mod. I believe they are quite powerful gauntlets. Um, not to be messed with. However, I think we can power these up. Bam. Do we, do we actually want them? Increase health recovery speed. That could be quite valuable to us. And they're... Oh, damn. They are very they are very good compared to what we're currently wearing. I tell you what. If we get the whole set, I'll put them on. Uh, but for now, let's have a look at what else is in the area. <gasps> Primal. Primal Raptor. A Primal... Oh, wait. Hold on a second. All right. I've just, I've just had my little, like, shock back to reality on how strong some of these dinosaurs actually are, yeah? Um, yes, my Argentavis is a very, very powerful. Yes, it did just take down a Chief Griffin or whatever that was. But, um, Primal Raptors still have, you know, 40 million health. My guy here ain't dealing health in the, in the millions just yet. So, we got a long way to go before my dude here is going to be, like, almighty and powerful. But for now, just let me take a seat. Let me re regenerate my guy here's stamina. I guess I can give you that, right? That helps you out a bit too, I think. Yeah, we should probably do more of that, to be honest. We should do a lot more of that. Feed them stimulants. That's literally the purpose of them. And here we go. Power up, big guy. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Where's my attack? Yeah. <laughs> Dude, that dealt like 5 million. I think because I hit him so close up. All right, all right, all right. This is, this is our new strategy, okay? Our new strategy is to just like go right up to the dinosaurs we want to kill and then drop the X-bomb. <laughs> I thought I killed it there, but it was showing someone else's health. Damn. Look at all the damage. That's ridiculous. But that was like a, that was like a 10 million attack. I, I like, I, you know, let's keep them going. Let's keep them going. Oh my gosh. So basically what we're doing it's, it's, it's kind of like firing a shotgun at close range. Instead of just hitting him with a few pellets, you're hitting him with every single shot, just about. And again. And again. Some of them don't hit as hard. Oh, no. He's still taking damage. Oh, interesting. I don't know what's still hitting him. Uh, but, my dude, you're about to die. <laughs> oh, he survived it. Are you serious? All right, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. All right, I got to be careful here. We don't want to enter the water. We do not want to enter the water. I just want to kill the primal raptor and get my butt out of here. I'm getting way too close to this water. All right, here we go. Here we go. Come on. He's trying to run, but we're not having it. Boom. There we go. Now, I have no idea what we just got. We got some blood. We got some hide um, and some other jazz. Nothing too crazy that we didn't already have in the first place. And while I'm here, look, as, as far advanced as we're starting to get, I still I still need to collect uh I still need to collect cementing paste and, and pretty much all of this other stuff. The wood I'll leave behind. What's with this power up thing again? No, I just want to ride you. 
I don't know why that is. Kind of interesting. Either ways, some more fabled dinosaurs over here. Uh, still looking for omegas, to be honest. Also, that guy didn't drop us any loot, unfortunately. But there is another little uh, thing I'm about to be right here. One second, let me grab this. We're probably going to have some upset beavers in a second, but so be it. All right, what do you got for me? Bam, bam, bam. And drop the wood. And let's get our butts out of here. Before we get some ink beavers in our face. Uh, so, I was thinking of actually smashing up these oil nodes while we're here. I'm just trying to think if we need oil. I think we do. But, ah, probably not right this second. All right, let's keep looking for some things to take down. So, things we are looking for. Things we want to find. Uh, oh, actually. I know the perfect... And the perfect place to go. I just realized there was a little adventure that we took through the Redwood Forest a while back. Um, we obviously got us, I think, a roll rat on that on that adventure. We also got us a buffoon nameless. It was a buffoon nameless. Uh, but on that adventure, we came across some rather crazy creatures as well. There were some reapers out here. I believe we saw a hint of what might have been another buffoon. Um, but what I'm thinking is... If there's some crazy strong dinosaurs out here in the Redwood Forest, there's also the chance we might find a crazy powerful origin as well, if we're lucky. Also, that's a very interesting looking patch right here. Wait a second. Why does this look so funky? All right. I was hoping maybe like we'd be able to get some like rare mushrooms or rare flowers or something, but no, it just turns out to be like, regular bushes i suppose <laughs> all right come on let's go Ooh, fabled woolly rhinoceros now that's a that's a new that's a new little find all right no wait did i just power up i'm trying to power down i thought we were powered up and now we're powered up and down and, uh, all around it doesn't matter we're powered down so good all right let's keep this going keep this going it's only a matter of time before we encounter an origin that we are looking for. Also, what do we have over there? Looks like a wyvern. Is it one of those weird ice wyverns? Yes, it's one of the Gaia mod wyverns. All right, that's fine. Not looking for one of them. No, we are not. But maybe over in this direction, we'll find something. In fact, the Redwood Forest is a pretty barren place, isn't it? There's not many dinosaurs out here. Where am I on the map? All right, we're like right at the tip. All right. Let's, um, yeah, there's like no dinosaurs out here. Is that because something crazy is just kind of like roamed through and killed everything? Or is that just like normal? <laughs> I have no idea. I haven't spent much time out here, to be honest. It's very quiet, though. I remember it being like this last time I played on this map. Uh, all right. Maybe, maybe all the dinosaurs are just hiding out over here. There's a lot of these Delaney's Frost Wavens. A lot of, the oh, oh, we got some. All right, we got some poison wyverns out here. We got some monogamous. We got some uranuses. We've got. Oh man, I gotta tame one of them at some point. I just I've never shown them much love at all, to be honest. Oh, hey turtle guy. I still want to tame up a mega shell on. I've never tamed one. Also, what are, what's the little birds? What are these little birds? What do they belong to? How interesting. Aren't they the little birds that follow around the Sky Titan? That doesn't mean there's like a Sky Titan around here, right? I've actually never seen the Sky Titan in the wild. All right. That is the sound of a chainsaw. Why is there a sound of a chainsaw? Hey? There's only one... There's only one dino... Well, there's only one creature I know in this game... That wields a chainsaw. And I'll be honest. Don't really want to find it. Is he down here? No. He's out here somewhere. Alright. Oh, I'll, I'll play. Oh, hey! You limo misses, man! I'm not a fan of him. Oh, snap! Hey, Dodo Rex. Hey, do it over there, big guy. Oh, that's that's like a that's like a true Dodo Rex as well. Okay, 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 okay. Alright. Um is that tameable? I don't think... No, it is. Tameable via KO. But how much torpor has it got? doesn't say. That's interesting. Do I waste any time with it? Or do I just... I'm just going to kill you. I'm just going to kill it. Maybe not. Maybe I'm not going to kill it. Oh, okay. No, we're still firing shots off. Hold on a second. Buddy. 
Can I get you out of that water, please? I kind of want to try and tame it. I don't have a boss tribute. I don't even know what a boss tribute is. How does one get a boss tribute? Boss. Here we go. Oh, 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 I don't have any artifacts. So even if I wanted to tame it, we couldn't do it. But then you got Alpha, Apex. All right. Yeah, 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 yeah. Makes sense, I guess. Makes sense. Um, but he's underwater now. Oh, well. I can still get you, buddy. What's with the... All my bullets just came out my butt. <laughs> they didn't go forwards. <laughs> All right, come on, buddy. Get out of there. Come fight me. It's no fun you being underground. Come on. Literally, all my, all my bullets are flying in the wrong direction. I can't get him. Why are you underwater? Come back up to the surface, mate. Oh, snap. There he is. <laughs> all right. Well, he listened. He didn't back down the beast, um, but he dead. So I guess he'll, he'll regret it. He'll regret his decisions. But this does not solve the question on what, what, what the whereabouts of Mr. Chainsaw Guy. Somebody be logging the trees. We must we must protect the trees. For real though. Where is it? Oh, it's not this guy. But we have stumbled across something ahead of us. Let me just get these little things off my screen because they're filling up too much space. A little bit of speed. A little bit of damage. Have a look. It is a buffoon megatherium, but I don't have six special kibble. But damn. I'll be damned if he does not look cool. Mmm, that's tough. That's tough. Ooh. Man, there's so many creatures out here that I just don't recognize. All right, well, look. None of you guys are what we're looking for. We're looking for an origin to kill. Oh, that's the guy I'm looking for. Hey, buddy. Oh, it has been... Oh, hello. Let me just take this guy down real quick. I need his little sacrifices. <gasps> that's what I'm looking for. The buffoon gigantopithecus. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Now, that's the type of guy, we'll say an Alpha Mantis, who's about to roam on over and try and annoy me. I'll go off all you. No. Buffoon Mega, me, uh, Mega Gigantopithecus, whatever his name is, is the type of guy that I can stop my origin hunt for and uh, try and tame up. All right. All right. All right. So, 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 so. Okay. Just trying to think about how we're going to go about this. Uh, one, I'm going to get my butt off the ground. Yep. Don't wanna, I don't want to, I don't want to fall to his chainsaws for a start, okay? Yeah, okay. Oh, hey, buddy. Freaking eight terabirds. Oh, you're not going to ruin this for me. You're not going to ruin it for me. All right. So I need four special kibble, okay? First things first, I'm going to head back to my base. Head back to my beloved home. I don't even know where home is right now. This place, right? Yes. Yes, that's the old base, okay? Uh, yes, we've got, we've got a separate teleporter in Eggsville, just so we know where everything is, all right? Okay. The hard part, hard part about this is I don't actually know what we can craft from where. Because all my resources are like split between two bases now for some silly reason. I really got to like finalize our move across to the new base. Either ways though, I need four of these. Can I have them? No. Alpha eggs? No. It can't be. No. That's fine. I'm pretty sure I've got some up at the old other base. All right, hold on. Um, uh, Light Griffin, come with me, buddy. Come with me, okay? And while we're here, we can actually uh, have a bit of a dabble with... Actually, why did I build a base up here? This is where the Apex Broodmothers always seem to live. Probably not the best idea, to be quite honest with you all. But it is what it is. Now, Alpha Eggs. We have seven of them. Is there any Alpha Eggs for me? No, you don't. Do you? You just got a lot of poop. All right. I got to turn off that poop collection if that's the case. Um, stop. Nope. Uh, collection options. Stop poop. Yeah, we've got enough poop. I, I'm, the fact he's got poop on him means that all of our compost bins are full of poop now. Kind of like me. Just, just, just full of poop. Just spills out my mouth for <laughs> 30 to 40 minutes a day through these videos. Uh, and my wife would probably argue the other 23 hours as well. Anyways, we'll get our eggs. Hopefully this is enough. I didn't actually check. But let's have a little look. So I need three now. What am I missing? <gasps> one alpha egg. One, one single alpha egg. You're going to make me go looking for a single alpha egg? All right. All right, fine. New plan. New plan. I'm crafting up a potion. 
Yep. And you guys know which one it's going to be. It's the gender elixir. N n n how? No, what? Guardian. How am I missing guardian elements? I have everything I need for them, I'm pretty sure. Or did I just not craft? I didn't craft the third one. All right, we're good. It's okay. False alarm. Had a little mini heart attack there. Just going to wait for that there to craft up. And hey, if anyone else wants to like lay me an alpha egg, that'd be absolutely fantastic. Um, speak now or forever hold your peace. I guess this means that I got to tame some alpha dinosaurs. Yeah, we got to get some alphas for the old Eggsville up there. We don't have any. It's probably like the last piece of the puzzle that we like truly need to be quite honest. Anyways, the reason I'm doing this is so that I can feed it to my, my Dimorphodon that's behind me. Turn him into a female and then hopefully he can lay us some eggs. Some alpha eggs. He's the only alpha I'm pretty sure that we've, actually, we've got tamed up. So we've got no choice. All right, there we go. So you don't have to waste any time, buddy. Just give us some eggs whenever you're ready. Also another celestial. Fantastic. All righty. Now we uh, play the waiting game. How do we even get alpha egg eggs up in the other base, by the way? Because like I shouldn't have any. I'm going to assume that we're just picking up wild alpha eggs or something. I have no idea. Um, but yeah, we're good. We're good. This is fantastic. Need that alpha egg. Need the alpha egg. So I waited a bunch of time. Um, no alpha eggs yet. I get the feeling that maybe just maybe the alpha di di dimorphodons just not lay eggs. <laughs> Could that be a possibility? Um, either way. If we had seven alpha eggs up here, there is a chance that maybe there is an eighth now. So let's just have a little peek. No, there isn't. All right, fine. I guess I got to go find one in the wild then. Hey, Breck, your buddy. You want to like lay me an egg or something, please? That'd be fantastic. Oh, you're kidding me. You're absolutely kidding me right now. <laughs> Well, hey, I guess if you ask politely, the wild dinosaurs sometimes are happy to help out. What can I say? That's why it always pays to show manners. Give me that final fellow. And now that we've gotten this far, we also, like I said, have our amazing new primal thingamabobby. What I can actually do is craft up some of these uh, special infused narcotic things. We can get like 10 of these. And with these... I think we should be able to get ourselves some primal infused bullets. Now, I don't know how much torpor these are going to deal, but I think it's going to be quite, I think it's going to be quite nice. I think it's going to be a really, really nice. All right, let's go. For the rest of this, I'm taking my light griffin with me. That way I don't need to like put myself in too much danger. But uh, last remote location, let's go get ourselves a buffoon gigantopithecus. Or in other words, a crazy monkey man. All right, buddy. Oh, I just had a reaper too. All right, where are you, crazy monkey man? I know you're around here somewhere. You were running at me with chainsaws a minute ago. But where? There he is. There he is. I knew he wouldn't be too far away. All right. So, let's test out these new bullets out of this new gun that we have here. It's going to be so good. Or should I just stick to my, my trusty old long neck? Nah, nah, nah. Oh, I missed! Do you know how expensive that bullet was? Oh, no. All right. Let's try again. Three, two, one. And maybe I'll wait till this stops moving. Maybe I don't want to shoot the shield on his back. All right. Let's go. Bam. 60, 70. All right. All right. 80,000 torpor. Not bad. All right. Can I drag him over here a little bit? Okay. 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 Now, this is the beautiful part. Bam. 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 <laughs> Just like that. <laughs> Who's fighting? It was a Gaia ant, apparently. All right, let's get rid of the terror bird. Um, we must have hit him with like three headshots in a row just then because somehow those three bullets that I just fired into him knocked him out. Somehow they dealt over 600,000 to... What? I don't even know. Anyways, get that into here. No, no. Oh, no, 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 no. This bad, this bad, this real, 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 real bad. Uh, one second. One second. I left one of the kibble back at the base. Oh, come on. Please, please, please. Effectiveness. Don't drop too much. Oh, no. I can't believe I forgot to pick it up. Oh, you dummy. You dummy. You dummy. There it is. There it is. All right. I'll take these as well. Oh, my gosh. All right. Back to back to the last remote location. 
Oh, please don't tell me I need a fifth one. I'll cry. I will legitimately cry. Where are you? He's over here. Okay, 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 okay. Oh, we're good. Oh, we're good. Oh, that's so lucky. And he doesn't need a saddle. Nice. All right, well, look. With the remaining time we've got left, I think it only makes sense to take this guy for a bit of a test drive. This, my friends, is a grand old day. We have tamed ourselves up the buffoon Gigantopithecus. Like I said, crazy monkey man. He is the friend of the buffoon and nameless that we tamed up a little while ago. Now it is time to see what he is made of. Oh, no. That's, that's a corrupted reaper. Why am I coming down here? Why? Okay, we're fine. No, we're not. That was a lot of that was a lot of that was a lot of fall damage. All right, let's let's heal you up, okay? We don't want to get you killed on day one. Oh. Turns out this whole time. The eggs we were looking for. Oh, guy ants, guy ants. You wanna do oh, 15,000 a hit? Um the alpha eggs we've been looking for are out here on the beach, apparently. Oh, this is good. If I knew that a little sooner, it would have been fantastic. Alright, let's see what we're made of. Let's test it out on these guys. So, left click was dealing about 50,000 damage. 15,000, sorry. It's going to be a little bit more in a second. Um, let's find out what other attacks we have. I heard rumors that this guy's had a bit of an upgrade since we last saw him. So, let's have a look. Right click. Here's the throw attack. Standard Gigantopithecus move. I see. See attack. Oh, he has berries. <gasps> hey! I just realized. Last episode. Wait a second. What is that? Level 1,140 Rex. Thing's got hair on it. Doesn't it? No. No, 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 no. What are you doing? Oh, no. Uh, uh, okay. Where are you going? Oh, he's scared. All right, pick me up, pick me up. Okay, now I'm... Okay, we're in trouble. We're in trouble. Are we in trouble? I have no idea. I don't know. That's okay. I'm on the back of my... I'm on the back of my monkey, man. It's all good. Okay, that that nearly got terrible. That, that, nearly, that nearly got bad. Um, why is this Rex so strong? This Rex isn't meant to be this strong. This isn't normal. That's not normal. What is, like, why is this Rex over level 1000? That's well past max level. All right, that was weird. That That's not meant, to, that's not meant to happen. Um, okay. Anyways, did I not say last episode? Oh, what are you now? That's a Chrono Rex. Fantastic. Um, hey, did I not say last episode that I want to go looking for a Gigantopithecus to tame up? <laughs> what a fluke. I was upset that we had to go and get fiber. Well, now we don't need to anymore because we can just pick up fiber like this. Nice. Okay. Do we have an X attack? Maybe we can test it out on this guy. Oh, the chainsaw attack. Of course. How about X? Sorry, control. We got a control attack or not? We can jump. No control. R, Q. Oh. I don't know what did that. But now I want to test out chainsaw bomb. I know Chrono. Why can't I move? Let's try this out. Yeah! <laughs> That's awesome. I thought these guys got a new attack, though. Maybe I'm just dreaming it. Unless there's an attack that I don't know how to deal or something. Oh, who knows? Who knows? But this guy's an absolute machine. I said I wanted one, and I got one. Let's take him back to base, and we can uh, call it a day. Well, guys, thank you all for watching this episode of our Primal Fear series. If you did enjoy the video, then please go ahead and punch. No, that's not what you're meant to do there, buddy. What you're meant to do is punch that thumbs up. Make it rain. Those thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. We are well on our way to 700,000, possibly by the end of the week. But most importantly, have a fantastic day, and I'll catch you next time. Bye for now.